Sabalski. Welcome back, everyone, and buckle up while you're at it, because this should be a doozy here this evening. Ray, I guess with what we're about to see on the ice, international relations could be impacted politically here in the world with this one tonight. Wow, that sounds like a pretty big game, James. How's that for a sell? I'm just thinking when you play with your country's flag on your chest, everything is a little different. It means a little more. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dot. Puck is dropped and we are underway. This has been one we've been waiting for for a while and it's time to finally see what the payoff is all about. On the deflection! That's a beautiful pass saved by the goalie there. And now he moves it quickly to Heiskanen. Right off the side of the net. Team Rush has got the puck along the wall. Now he takes it over the line. From in close! A quick one here! And look at this! The first goal of the game! Man, I don't even think anyone's really settled into the game yet. And already we have the game's first goal. Hey James, I thought the goalie had this till about the fourth deke. And then he's out in the corner. He's got no chance. What a goal. Russia's first goal has completely silenced this home crowd. Everybody's expecting a quick start from the home team when it doesn't happen. Everyone, fans and players, are back on their heels a bit. Granlin's able to get everything behind this hit. He really lays one on here. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Radulov. Here's a shot, denied by the goaltender. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Let's see the call here. He's going off for tripping, and doesn't everybody feel like they're innocent on a trip? You feel like you're innocent on most every penalty, but this one always feels like, God, did you really have to call it? Past the midway mark in this period, 1-0 the score. Hollis won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. Comes up with the stop as he got a piece of the blocker on it. Slides the puck across to Malkin. Shot, and that one stopped. Finland's gained possession along the boards. Kapanen's got it in the offensive zone. Turns it away. He scores! Followed through to the net, he picks up this rebound, makes no mistake. Once the goalie leaves the puck in front of the net, the goalie's at your mercy, and he does not miss. Granlin's one possession, and now it's grabbed by Ristolainen. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Slides it across to Sergachev. Feeds the puck to Kovalchuk. Trying to get free! 1-1 one, one is where we sit after the first 20 minutes of play. During the game, please remember to be alert at all times in our seating area. Even with enhanced safety measures, there are moments when the puck can be propelled into the spectating area with enough force to cause injury. So please stay alert at all times when the game is in play. And while both teams get a refresher, we'll take one ourselves heading into the second period. Takes it across the blue line, uses the force on that hit, and they come up empty-handed. Team Finland's got it in the neutral zone. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. Kucherov's going off to the box for two minutes. Played with fire, he got burned, Ray. Oh, he's digging around for the puck, and sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down, and he's got to go to the box. Still tied here as the power play fails to come up with a goal. 
Oh, I really like the penalty kill there. They were on the same page almost all over the ice that entire power play. The game stays tied because of their fine work. Oh, I love the way they played this shift. They protected the puck well, but now they've got it and they can run around the zone. The defenders can't chase them. They're too tired. On the attack along the boards. Scores! And he puts his team in front. James, this game looked really comfortable as a tie game. Now they're ahead. They've got to continue to push. He didn't waste any time. If he would have stopped that puck, the goalie would have had time to readjust. As it is, it's in the net. Team Russia is going to try to hang on to this lead here in the late goings of this second. And it's not by back on your heels. It's by being aggressive, by forechecking, play defense in the other team's end. Lays into the body. Gets in front of it. That was a big hit. You've got to be willing to put your own body on the line to make a hit like that. Team Finland's had their opportunities, but they still trail late in this second period. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And there's the save. Hard sounds bringing the second period to an end. So two periods in the books, and it's 2-1. As a safety issue and courtesy of you, our fellow fans, please keep the aisles clear during gameplay wait for a break in the action to lead. Third period just team. around the corner. Ray and I will be ready to bring all the action in moments. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James. Third period action ready to go. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. 40 minutes into this one here, Razor. How do you see things? Finland's pace and effort makes me think they're going to find this tying goal here, James. They've had the puck most of the first two periods. Handles the puck. Shot denied by the blocker. Grabbed along the board by Malkin. Centering pass. Off the crossbar. What an opportunity right there. Takes the feed. From point blank range, a rocker off the blocker. I want to get another look at this one, James. This looks like it hurts. I'm glad I'm in a suit here. And now it's grabbed by Lindell. Knocked away. Here's a short pass to make it a double G. The great love save. Achilles' heel tonight has been finding offense as they trail here in the third. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Officials blowing the play dead. We've got a penalty on the way here. Vatnin's getting handed a game misconduct here. Uh, certainly no way to come back from this. The officials made his decision. And you got to chew on this as you skate by your teammates and out of the... Kucherov's got it along the boards. Slides the puck near the front of the net. Gives them nothing in front. Great reflexes, another save. He gets that one too. Smothered that in close chance. Through center along the wing. They desperately need a goal. The net is empty and the extra attacker's out. And now it's over to Ovechkin. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Malkin. Wide Whoa. open net. And there's the insurance marker much needed for them on this night. It's amazing how many times a guy misses an empty net, but this one he puts between the pipes. Well, now you got a couple of goal lead here with the empty netter. That should be enough to put this away. Team 
Rush has added to their lead with the empty netter, and Ray, that's pretty much all she wrote, I would say. Well, you grind away to get the lead through this much of the game, and they pull the goalie, they're gonna pressure you. You put it away with an easy one into the empty net. Denies him with the save! Rush is gonna hold him in against the wall. We got a delayed call coming up here as the referee raises his hand, and the officials stop the play. Let's see what the call is. Looks like he's going off for 40. Good call. I don't know that this is a penalty 15 years ago, though. <laughs> I believe they call that back in the day, right? Rips it and rips it just oh. wide. They say it's a game of inches, James. If that puck is a couple of inches to the side, that hits the post and goes in. And that one's turned away. I like this stop here. He makes the save. He looks in control. And the rebound's 30 to 40 feet away. Final buzzer sounds, and this one's in the books. They push right to the end, and they got the goaltender out, James. That's your last chance. You give everything you can, see if you can equalize. It just didn't work out for them. You never liked being on the ice for those empty netters, did you? No, those are those hurt your plus-minus column. I know that stat doesn't mean what it used to, but it still but hurts. But it still stings. Yeah. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us tonight.